Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to take a look at a song by Ricky Lee Jones, one of my favorites. Everything off her first album is fantastic. This song was requested to me. I went and gave it a listen and said, oh yeah, we'll do it. Let's take a look at the song called Weasel and the White Boys Cool. Now, the song is based off of these two chords. We're going to play a G6-9 which will be G, E, A, D. This basically here is like a stacked four. We have the E to an A to a D. Even the G on top would be the full stacked four, but we have the G in the bass. So it's to an A. So the intro is this. Then we go to the verse. Sal was working at Nero's downtown. Sal and I are causing cars to the people downtown. So it does that twice. The third time, it's going to go to a D7. And now it's going to go to this section of the song, which is like a pre-chorus. So we have an A. Then we play this chord, which is like an A1309. You can call it A7 out of 1113 to this A7, and it just keeps going back and forth. Now this is how Ricky plays it, but the record there's an electric guitar, so I like to mix both and I play it like this, after this chord. So I add that, that hammer on to the major, these two notes three notes and I'm adding the C sharp from the C does it four times then it goes back okay does the exact same thing repeats the verse the same way back to the pre-chorus after this pre-chorus now it's going to go to the chorus and the chorus is this d a g g over f d a e sus4 g over a to a C, G, D, C, B flat, G over A, technically you could call it an A11, but since we're not resolving to the D, we're going back to the four chord, to the G69. Then it's going to repeat everything two more times, I believe, and that's the whole song. So let me just play the chorus, and we'll call it a day. Sell, say goodbye to your mom and your dad. Sell, say goodbye to the barrio. Sal, say goodbye to Buddies and pals, Angela, Perry, and Mario.
fun song to play. I love this song. It's a great song. I love everything on the first Ricky Lee Jones album. I believe it was the first album I posted as my most overlooked albums of all time. I dig it. You know you dig it. Very good. <laughs> 